What's up guys, Tech Up Shooter, and strangely enough, Apple has just dropped iOS 11 Beta 7 to the registered developers on Monday. So, it was always on Tuesday, but now it's on Monday. Yeah, pretty strange. But anyways, uh, this is a pretty insignificant update. It weights around 100 megabytes, comparing to the previous Beta 6, which was 250. It's a pretty small one, and I can tell there are not many features found in this one. So, nevertheless, I hope guys that you will enjoy this video, and let's get started. And okay guys, so just before we're gonna move on to the features i wanted to say that you can actually grab the ios 11 beta 7 on the apps for the iphone.net and the link will be down below in the description guys so don't worry about that so here in the apps for the iphone in this main tab that's on the bottom on the center and this is the ios 11 beta here profile so grab it right now in order to install this beta yeah and okay guys so the first feature that i was able to find in this ios 11 beta 7 is the new icon in the music in the control center so if you access the control center then 3d touch on the music you will see this new icon on the left top corner in here so it doesn't do anything unfortunately it's kind of like on the ios 10 uh, this is how it looks like on the ios 10 but unfortunately it doesn't do anything so on the ios 10 as you can see when i try 3d touching yeah or just pressing as you can see that takes me to the music app but here it does nothing the second change is a bug it's a pretty ridiculous one but it doesn't work and your calculator app may fail so as you can see when i try to type in the one plus two plus three as you can see that gives me a result of 23 that's because the plus doesn't work between the two and the three so let's do this once again it was the four five and six four plus five plus six as you can see the plus sign is not working in here and unfortunately the 3d touch bug has not yet been fixed so if you try to 3d touch on something this will give you a kind of a laggy animation still and yeah that's a very unfortunate thing in here and yeah these are all the changes that were found in the ios 11 beta 7 unfortunately there is not many just two of them that's, that's just for now but yeah there are some little small changes that are not noticeable at this point but i can tell that ios 11 beta 7 feels just a little bit faster and I guess they are just, you know, kind of preparing this whole iOS 11 for the final release. So definitely you can go ahead and install this one right now on your main device because it feels much, much faster than the beta one. I remember the beta one was just a terrible thing. So now it is completely changed. And you guys, this should be pretty much it for today. These are all the changes. Thank you so much for watching. Of course, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you share it with your friends. Also hit that like button. It will be so, so much appreciated like always. And as always, guys, stay tuned for more videos. Videos and peace out.